Former U.S. President John F. Kennedy famously wrote of America as a nation of immigrants, a concept that has become all the more poignant since President Donald Trump wrote an executive order slamming the door shut on refugees several days back. Many in the hip-hop world are speaking out against Trump's hardline immigration policies, including Nicki Minaj, who emigrated to America with her family after being born in Trinidad. Referring to herself as a proud immigrant, Nicki tweeted that the most harmful thing you could ever take away from another human being is hope. Nicki's stance on Trump's moves has been reflected elsewhere in the hip-hop industry. Amine and Made in Tokyo have both condemned Uber for their CEO's involvement in Trump's strategic and policy forum. Public enemies Professor Griff, who is himself a Muslim, joined protesters at LAX airport to speak out against the ban and told reporters that Donald Trump needs to meet with real black people rather than Kanye West and Steve Harvey. Griff also encouraged artists not to just protest against Trump on social media, but to make music against the executive order. Russell Simmons, co-founder of Def Jam, the man who recently sold his Rush card business for $167 million, and the man who was once friends with Donald Trump has roundly criticized the new president on Twitter, rebuking the ban, the plans for a border wall with Mexico, and Trump's pick for Attorney General Senator Jeff Sessions. Akon, who is a Muslim Senegalese citizen, thinks that Trump's main problem is giving the people too much information. Akon also expressed worry that the ban would make Americans targets when traveling abroad. Think more within hip hop should speak out? Let us know what you think in the comments section and don't forget to subscribe. And as always, for more music and news, hit us up at hiphopdx.com.